Hello everybody, my name is Jack Jack Sage and welcome to Path of Shadows. This is a game, this is an indie game made by five students as a portfolio project. Uh, this only has three areas in it, so it's not going to be really too long of a game. Get a few episodes out of this. and The entire thing, the engine and everything, was made from scratch, so it might be a little buggy. But here we go. I opened this earlier to try it out to do the tutorial and learn everything. And it's a really good looking game. The art style kind of looks like Dishonored in a way. If any of you have seen that game, it's really good. Game. And it's kind of like this in that some of the abilities in it are like what you would see in that. But I'm not going to spend all the time comparing these two. I just really like this game Come because closer. it's about controlling shadows. Always been the kind of thing I've always wanted to be able to do. Come closer, said the statue. Yeah, walking into the light's a great idea. This, this, this game's all about shadows and paths of shadows. I think I'm gonna talk to a crow lady. I reincarnated your soul in a new body. Do not bother remembering anything. I will now lend you some of my power. You can now control the shadows at your will. The glyphs on your back show your current power. Okay. I think I just missed what she said. Oh yeah, this is a... Aim and your power will be consumed when you manipulate the shadows, or when you stand near a strong source of light. Refill your power staying in the shadows. You see what I mean? This is kind of reminiscent. One of the powers is like. Sometimes uh, you won't find shadows nearby. Use your new powers to create your own path of shadows. To, to warp to places like that. One guard. Really cool. Others will be around. Kill him silently. The, uh, the killing mechanics. I love it in this game. But you just uh, kept that. Thank you. Bye bye. And then to hide a body, hide the body. You just whoosh, and then it melds into the shadows. That is so cool. And of course, running. <laughs> You're not limited by your physical body now. I'm still curious about that. Apparently you've been resurrected. She, like, there was some great war or something and you disappointed her. And now she wants you to not disappoint her. Uh, uh, hi. No, he can't see me if I don't move. That's just letting me know he's there. He could see me if I move. Nope. He's now dead and begun into the shadow. Away with you. Over here, too. That guy was past this fence, I think. This, this. Yep. Hey. Hey. I know he's got a light on his back. I don't care. I'm gonna kill him. Come on, come on, turn around, turn around. You just go back where you can. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, that's right. Yeah, yeah. Kaboosh! Slit your throat. Back into the shadows I go. In retrospect, I probably shouldn't have blocked my path up there. Oh, that's the walking sound. Whoops. I thought I was hearing something behind me. 
It's like, what the heck is walking around in my room? Oh. Sneaky, sneaky. Master assassin. Now I'm walking right through the light when I could just... Oh, come, come, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on. Ah, oh, screw it. Alright. <laughs> this is why I'm glad I played the tutorial earlier. I kept dying from this guy because you cannot get in between that light. It is not possible. At all. Oosh. And because I like kill. Wait, what? Aerial kill? I did not see that earlier. Oh. That is cool. <laughs> that is pretty cool. Alright, I liked that. That was a really cool one there. And into the light, through the door, to the village. Yeah, this is. This is a really I give you a second chance after your disgrace.